Shaquille O'Neal, Antoine Jameson, both their best games of the series in game three. Meanwhile, for the Boston Celtics, they know everyone's got to pick it up if they want to stop this train, Cavaliers. It was the best road playoff win in their franchise history and was the worst home playoff loss for the Celtics in their franchise history. And our Spanish, Spanish language version of today's game presented by ESPN Deportes. Use the SAP button on your television. Shaq got off to a good start the other night. And Perkins swats away his only one in the conference semifinals that will definitely not be a sweep. Some impressive performances in the last couple of days as Ray Allen nails a two-pointer as foot was on the line. You make coaches, that's obvious. That's obvious. That's a, that's a situation where you're allowing Jameson to go to his strength. Rondo goes to one of his shooting team in the NBA playoffs. They've been terrific, and that's not out of the norm because during the regular season, they were the third best shooting team. Rondo scoots inside. Here's James leading the break, so dangerous. Knocked away from behind by Rondo. See, that effort by Rondo right there, that's a winning effort. You didn't see that in game three. This effort, they've struggled to guard him so far, but this is a dead sprint. You want to win, you run back. Post. Garnett so effective in the first two games. Shaq's pass deflected. When James takes a shot they want him to take, and he's still able to make it. Jameson misfires. Mondo, one of the best rebounding point guards in the league, grabs that one. Kicks it out, Allen. Allen on the drive, the floater. Nice shot from Ray Allen, his second holiday look. Jeff, do you think the reason that Allen is on LeBron James is... Oh, Perkins with another block. And Rondo the rebound. Rondo kicks it back out. Allen for three. Too strong. Pierce the rebound. Back up. Count it. And a foul. So Doc Rivers having to go to the bench early with the foul problems for Perkins and Pierce. Garnett back door. Nice setup. And good eye contact with Rondo. Played that exceptionally well. To me, Ray Allen's mental toughness as every bit as impressive as his shooting. Rondo left open. That was part of the Cavs' strategy. Garnett had his knee injury. This used to be a staple. When Garnett would come to the pick and roll, if you tried to cheat it, he's going to back cut. Rondo was going to throw it up. This is a perfectly placed pass. Delonte West off the mark. Rondo looking to push. He already has three assists, six points. Left-handed shot won't go. Garnett took it away from Barajal and lays it in. She's in the NBA, so deep a team. James off balance three, has to shoot it as the shot clock is winding down. Rondo, the drive. Rondo, the layup. Rajon Rondo, a terrific start. Marie Jackson is the head coach. And I am going to go to the game as Rondo's foul. And I am going to heckle her like she heckled <laughs> me and our coaches and the referee. And then we got to make them shoot jump shots. Hickson. Look at Rondo, battle, throws it off, Farajal. Rajon Rondo has five rebounds already. For a guy 6-1, he is an amazing rebounder. And their whole attention to detail was better. Good effort by Rondo, but they didn't close to deep. But signed him up. He'd love to stay here in Boston. He's already made that clear. Rondo knocks down the shot. Boy, what a first period for Rondo. 11 points. A big part of that. 11 points, three assists, five rebounds in that first quarter. What's the defensive strategy on for him? Uh, you know what? He's doing a great job of getting to... Puts up a three. That won't go. Different shooting. Again, you look in game three as Rondo inside. Blocked, but a foul. Rondo hit as Hickson went to block it. Or excuse me, Shaq. Come on, baby, come on. Yeah, it was West hitting in the... First of all, they don't have him counting out. San Antonio is making a mistake. I think they could pull off what Portland did a few years back, where they were down 3-0 to Dallas, won three straight, and played a great seventh game. Ray Allen hits a three, and the Celtics back up by eight. Allen with... This is where Rondo has played exceptionally well. Watch the defense collapse in transition. Found Ray Allen. Friday night after 22 in the 
game two victory in Cleveland. And he has erupted here as West got blocked, swatted away. Third block from Perkins. Rondo goes to James. And a blocking foul called on LeBron James. Everything going to sus. And that looked like a good call for the first time. Said a couple of Celtic. James has Rondo on him on the switch. Now is in. Perkins got a piece. James gets it back. And a travel. Mike Half the right way. Rondo with Parker in pursuit. Rondo gets hit again and throws the ball up. And he'll get to the free throw. Mm -hmm. Make with the players that you don't include. And Rondo fought in him, even though he had his up and down rookie season. And boy, as he come through for his lead. Just under five to play here in the second. Here in game four. Parker, another foul. Parker just can't as good a defender. He's doing it with a minimum number of dribbles. Well, that's exactly as he took a shot after releasing the field goal attempt. Garnett running the floor and banks it in. Pass slow to get back. Garnett's four of six in this series. He's had success. Rondo floats it up and in. Rondo, 18 points. Trading, breaking down the defense, pick and roll, you go underneath. I'm not selling for a jump shot. I'm going to beat you on my terms. Stella half with Pierce, who is struggling this series. Ray Allen having a big first half. And Kevin Garnett, but maybe the most indispensable player on this team right now is Rajon Rondo, who grew up playing all sports. He was a pitcher in baseball, quarterback. Now seven. Rondo to Garnett. Good open look. Garnett. Five of seven from the field. Celtics back up by nine. Time report. Rondo to Davis. Davis draws the foul. Except from that play you talked about earlier, but he's battled James. Ball poked away. Picked up by Pierce. Rondo takes it away. Here comes Rondo. Fake strides. Layup won't go. You take a look at the numbers, and they don't lie. Not only scoring, but doing the rest. Eight rebounds and seven assists. Not about his scoring, but he is making plays, getting into the paint area. Parker, 10 points for the five starters and double figures for Cleveland. Ray Allen's good shooting continues. That's I'm the master of the obvious. <laughs> Parker deflected by Rondo. The NBA steals leader gets one there and then draws the foul. Garnett has to shoot, puts up a three, nearly banks it in. Rondo, the offensive rebound, his ninth rebound of the game. Trailed by as many as 11. Allen, too strong. Rondo cuts to the basket, and a foul on West. It's come a long way, their relationship. Not good. Two minutes left here in the third. Rondo the penetration, flips it up, and a late with I think if you're Rondo right now, looking at the lineup, I think Tony Allen's got it. Hey, right now, it's 70, with 119 remaining. Third quarter, Cavs trying to take a 3-1 lead in this series. Tony Allen bumps James, stolen by Davis. A hit to Rondo. Rondo, one man to beat, swoops back to Allen. Pretty pass, and the finish. Rajon Rondo with his ninth assist of the afternoon. West open three won't go terrific once again here this afternoon understanding making the right decisions I see you Mr. James drops it off to Allen great read by Rondo he just has such a feel for the game that's what Mike Brown keeps saying and since James coming in James who love those loves those chase down blocks was Rondo's played all but a minute. Inside to Allen. Reverse layup. Oh, pretty play from Tony Allen. As this is a huge game right now. You not want to fall behind. 3-1 against the Cavs. Tony Allen with a steal. Allen on the drive. Back for Rondo. And he lays it in. Tony Allen making plays off. Good ball movement. Parker open three. Won't go. Hicks him. Puts his head down. Bad decision that time. Back-to-back -back turnovers. This time the pass gets to Glenn Davis, and he lays it in. Celtics back up by six. Timeout Cleveland. Tell you what, Ocho Cinco, look out for Uno Uno. That's outstanding wide receiver work.
catching it in the middle of traffic, bringing it down and then finishing. Way to go, you big baby. Also, <laughs> Coach Ray Allen is an assistant at UConn. James, head down, drives, won't go. One of the best on the drive. Block. Davis and Wallace converge. Rondo to baby. Big baby Davis banks it in. 8 0 run to start the fourth. Timeout Cleveland. It's stormed out to start the fourth quarter. Rondo pushing the ball, patiently waiting. Davis. I see Parker really playing off him again. Rondo pull up jump shot. Knocks it down. 25 for Rondo. You're an extension of the coach on the floor. Talk about it. Let's diagram it. Let's go through it. And then let's execute it on the floor. Directing traffic. Being a point guard. Being a quarterback. Putting the ball. Home. It's Jameson. As he settled. Back for James. Inside. Layup. Rolls off the rim. Tipped away. Rondo tracks it down. 13 rebounds for Rajon Rondo. Bounce pass. Beautiful block by James. But a foul. James. Farajal, corner jumper. Another rebound for Rondo. And about Perkins posting up. Ray Allen. On the drive, blocked by Farajal. Rondo goes at Parker. Inside to Pierce and the finish. Beautiful pass from Rondo. Celtics back up by five. Barnett spinning, head fake, bank shot, won't go. Rondo, another rebound, puts it back up and in. Rajon Rondo with a brilliant performance, the triple double, and the Celtics back up by seven. This is called making something out of nothing. James loses vision, Pierce, good cut, good strong finish, and then getting in the mix, finding a way not only to rebound it, to get it up over the shot blockers. Tremendous basketball plays. Perkins has got a hard body as James misses. Williams, a very good free throw shooter, misses both, and that will do it. You know what, though, and you make a good point. They decided they couldn't come back in this game. But see, I've been a. And I've been in a situation like that where basically you're coaching for the future, where you never quit as a team. Meanwhile, Rondo, carrying chance of MVP as he's able to cap off one of the great playoff performances in the storied history of the Boston Celtics. Now 28 points, 18 rebounds for a 6 1 point guard. 13 assists, a couple of steals as well. Five Tuesday night in Cleveland. Williams blocked by Tony Allen, got a piece of it. And the Celtics have even the series at two games apiece. A remarkable performance from Rajon Rondo, the triple double. And the Celtics still very much alive in the hunt for a championship. I was trying to be aggressive, hit my bigs out on the glass, and uh, as far as the assist, guys made shots tonight. Now the guys are saying that to them, they believe that this is one of the greatest playoff performances in Celtic history. When you hear that, knowing this storied history, how does that make you feel? It's definitely an honor. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. Tune in ABC Monday night, 8 Eastern, and all new Dancing with the Stars. Now, except on the West Coast, stay tuned for ABC World News or local news on most of these stations. For Jeff and Mark and Lisa and our entire ABC crew, this is Mike Green saying so long for Boston. Thanks for watching ABC.